Today I am revamping my basement sitting area. Um, as you can see, I just touched up my fireplace um, with some black paint, the same black paint that's used on my walls for accent walls in the basement um, because the fireplace is a, like a um, chestnut brown. Um, the black paint, because I didn't prime it or anything, so it, I didn't seal it, so it, it probably won't last that long, but the um, the paint looks like it's kind of like a dark gray, like a charcoal gray instead of black, but that's fine. I just wanted to just clean it up a little bit because the fireplace is old, you know, and so um, didn't really want to be replacing it. It's just down there in the sitting area, you know, and so... Next, I have purchased that area rug from Burlington back like at the beginning of August. And I paid $59.99 for that rug at Burlington. It was a six by nine. And the reason that I got it, um, I got it because of the blue in the rug. And I, I knew the, like I had bought um, different decorations to, to um, pillows and stuff like that. And I, I knew I wanted that blue and the blue that's in that in the rug area rug is the blue that I was going to be using. So I didn't pay attention to how the de design was in the rug and didn't even really pay attention that it's so much, so many light colors in it. So just too much for a basement. And so, um, yeah, I don't think I'm going to keep that. So, um, I end up, um, I, I, you know what, when I purchased that rug, actually, I purchased that one, and then I also went to Walmart, and I saw a rug there that had the blues and grays in it, and I bought that one also, because I bought the smaller one for my bathroom and bought the area rug for the basement, but the area rug was a five by seven, and I knew I wanted something a little bit bigger than that. I really like the design on it. I wish I would have kept that instead, but um, anyways, I ended up taking that rug back to Burlington, and just got a refund. Well, they gave me a store credit because it had went way over the time, even though I had my receipt. So I ended up going to the um, to the um, at home store and picked up another one. But here are the pillows, the rug that I just showed you guys, and then these pillows and throwing everything. I did that in a hall way back then. So if some of you can remember. Yeah, but that rug I took back to Walmart. I really, really like that rug. I should have kept it. Now I'm just laying the pillows on the couch, setting the pillows on the couch. And those blue pillows are, um, you can change the cover on them. This feather field, I really like that. And, um, really nice really nice my red vase that's that's sitting there I've had it I had it for a few years um I got it from the at-home store and the reason why I, I got it so cheap too it was like I think I paid up paying like $25 for it and that's because it has scratches on it and I think it's regular $69 or $79 in there and um so I'm glad I got that and still have it, even though it's, it's got a lot of scratches on it. You really just can't see it um, more since I got it home, <laughs> since it's been in my house. Um, so those are the blue pillows and the blue throw in which I am loving. Um, that canvas, if you can see part of the canvas on the picture behind the couch, I have had that thing for about 10 years and um, I kind of added colors to that when I, you know, first got it. So like I said, it was in my living room upstairs. It's been in the basement for years now and I am going to DIY that canvas. Instead of buying a new canvas or another picture, I DIY that one. So I'll just um, insert a clip on this video so that you can see the before and after on that. Those little bean bags, I had did the haul on that also. Those were from the at-home store um, during college time when people was getting ready for school. Um, they're regular $39.99. I paid $20 a piece for them. If, 
and they're sturdy too. So you can use them to prop your feet up or either. I got it for extra seating for my grandkids though, but you can prop your feet up on them if you're on a couch and just want to kick back, you know, or lay down. <laughs> So now I'm getting ready to use one of my granddaughter's hair balls. <laughs> I'm going to use that as a tie back, y'all. Don't laugh. But I'm tying them curtains back some kind of way. I'm going to use that. So I use those, her hair balls in my bathroom a lot too. <laughs> oh, so sometimes you can't even see them anyways. But, you know, they, they hold the curtains back pretty well. Okay, so next, here's the rug that I ended up going to get. I went back to the at-home store. I purchased this little rug for $39.99. And I like it because it's kind of, give you that old school feel. You know, the little rugs some of you probably had in your home. Well, your mama's probably had in your grandmother's <laughs> when you was growing up. But anyways, a little old school rug. Um, I really like it. It was hanging up in the store. It caught my eye. And I said, okay, I'm, that's the one I'm going with. I had a blue one, solid blue in the color of the pillows. And I put it back to get this one because it had more colors in it. And it just gave me that vibe, that old school vibe, you know. So... Everything else that I'm pretty much using in the um, to do my basement is I shop my home for uh, some of the things I know you probably already seen before. But for the, the newcomers, I shop my home for for mostly everything. And like I said, the pillow, the throw I had already had, the pillows I bought back in the beginning of August in that first rug I had bought in the beginning of August. And this is my first time pulling that stuff out. The only thing I had to do was take that rug back and just get something different. And so far, I am loving the look. Very comfortable, very cozy. It's always been that way down there. But I like change. So, you know, it's getting ready to change to spring pretty soon. I just want to get started a little earlier. So, because I, I have other projects in here I want to get to. Okay, guys, I hope that you guys enjoyed the rest of the video. Um, like I said, I'll insert the pictures of the, the before and after of the, of the canvas. I hope that you enjoyed um, the decorate with me. And um, 
If you're new to my channel, please subscribe, like, and share, and leave a comment. And also for my YouTube family, I would like for you to do the same. Like, share, and subscribe. If you haven't subscribed or you know somebody that you want to share this with, go ahead. Um, and I appreciate you all watching. I, I appreciate everything from you guys. And like I said, I hope you enjoy the video.